Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of the Passion of Fishing. Mi gente, hola, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo están? Bienvenidos una vez más a La Pasión por la Pesca. Este video es solo para decirle gracias a todos por su apoyo, por ver mis videos. Y pues nada, estoy feliz porque a ustedes les gusta lo que yo hago, les gustan mis videos. Y nada, este video como les digo solo para decirle gracias. También les voy a estar dejando un video muy importante de cómo usar el Peter Crab. Um, normalmente se usa, lo uso más con el Fish Finder Rig. Esta es la manera de cómo usarlo en Cambridge. Espero les guste. De nuevo, muchas gracias por los videos y nos vemos pronto en el siguiente video. Okay? Si les gusta, re recuérdense de darle like al video, compartirlo con sus amigos pescadores y suscribirse al canal abajo, mi gente. Muchas gracias. Everyone, so this video is just for say thank you to all of you guys who watch my videos. Uh, right now, we just hit 1,000 subscribers. I'm very happy, you know. I'm glad because uh, you guys like my videos. You guys like what you see here on my channel. Uh, I'm very glad, you know. Thank you to all of you guys. Thanks a lot for the support. And also, I'm going to leave in here one very important video for you guys on how to rig the pillar crab you know most of the time when i use the pillar crab for bait i like to um use the fish finder rig and this video uh is going to show you how to fish in cambridge you know so because we normally fish from the bridge using the uh fish finder rig but I didn't use the slider, so what I use is the egg sinker, uh, three ounces egg sinker. Watch the video, and remember guys, if you like what you see in, uh, in here on my channel, subscribe to my channel, share the video with your friends, and like the video, everyone. Thanks a lot for the support, guys. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys like this next video, how to rig the pillar crap. What you need is just um, a number six circle hook, about four ounces or three ounces egg sinker is what I normally use in Cambridge. Uh, two feet or three feet of uh, of the leader. I use fifty pounds monofilament uh, most of the time to my leaders. And uh, I think that's it, guys. Watch the video. I hope you guys like it. Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks a lot. I really appreciate it. Now we are 1,000. Thanks. Thanks a lot, everyone. Another thing I didn't show in this video how to use the legs of the crab, but what you have to do is just crush it with something, you know, hit it with something and uh, get the meat of the legs and use them maybe for perch or you can use a couple pieces and a big hook and maybe you can catch stripers too, you know, it's very simple. Mi gente, pues en este video no les enseño cómo usar las legs, las, las patas de los crabs, la más grande, pero lo que tienen que hacer es solo golpearla, sacar la carne de, la, de, la, de las legs y usarla en pequeños hooks para perch o puedes poner varios pedazos de, de las patas del cangrejo cuando le sacas la carne en un hook grande y tirarla. Okay, all right, guys. I think that's it. Again, thanks a lot, everyone. I hope you guys like this video, and see you soon in the next video, everyone. Remember, share the video, subscribe to my channel, and give this video and all my videos a like. Thanks, guys. All right, thanks a lot, everyone. Mi gente, muchas gracias. Nos vemos en la siguiente. Espero disfruten este video y sea de su ayuda. Fish on, everyone. Hey guys, so what I have in here, what I'm going to be using today in here is this three ounces egg sinker with about three feet of um, of line of uh, 50 pounds monofilament and this uh, J hook. It's basically the uh, fish finder rig, but we replace the slider for this egg sinker. Mi gente, pues, básicamente esto es el fish finder rig, pero se reemplaza 
el Fish Finder Rig, que es el slider, se reemplaza por el X Sinker, que él se puede mover sin necesidad de ponerle un slider o algo así. Es lo, así es como se hace aquí, así es como lo hacemos nosotros aquí en Cambridge. Ok. Okay, there we go, guys. Like I said, like a three feet of 50 pounds monofilament, my swivel, and three ounces X sinker, just like that. Okay, everyone, now have to prepare the pillar crab. Have to rip your pillar crab. Check it out. This one in here, first thing, take this front legs off. Ah, ya lo tienen de aquel lado en la leyelera. Ahora, now, you have to use the scissors for this next step. Don't throw this away. Yeah, away. Yeah, yeah. Don't throw this and legs away because when I use them later, I'm gonna show you later how to use them. So take the top shell off and this one on the bottom too. Just like that. Now very important, you need a scissors to uh, prepare the pillar crab. So cut it try on on the middle, cut it in half. You can use the half of the pillar crab or you can just cut it just, just like that guys. Okay. Just like that. Okay. Now how to rig the crab. Very important how. So you wanna put your hook in here. in the sockets of the crab, of the, I mean the sockets of the, the legs of the crab. Así es como se hace amigos, just like that guys. Now you can throw your bait, just like that. Así amigos, ya vieron como lo hice, lo cortas en dos partes, o si quieres también en cuartos, si el crab tiene un buen size, lo puedes cortar en cuatro partes. Yo esta vez lo corté en cuatro, aquí tengo para cuatro tiros, así se hace. Y pues ya nomás vamos a tirar, a ver qué suerte nos toca hoy. Espero que lo hayan visto y que lo disfruten. If you like what you see here, guys, remember, subscribe, give this video a like and share the video with the, in other people. That way we uh, can go fishing, everybody, you know. All right.